Hello, I'm Lionel Fern from driverskills.com and today I'm going to take you through an all in depth explanation on how the Isuzu pickup trucks four wheel drive system works and also compare the all new Isuzu D Max with the older Isuzu Rodeo. Both pickups have three different transmission settings 2H, that's two wheel drive to the rear wheels, 4H, which is four wheel drive in a high ratio, and 4L, which is also four wheel drive but with a low ratio for off roading. The three different drivetrain options are electronically selectable in both pickups. However, the new Isuzu D Max has a more refined system that offers improved ergonomics and graphics on the driver's dash display. The new graphics aren't the only difference between the two trucks, as the older Isuzu also featured a limited slip differential as standard. Now, limited slip differentials offer additional mechanical grip if the rear wheels encounter a loss of traction. I'm going to use these rollers to show you how this works. The transmission has been set into standard two-wheel drive and when we try and set off you'll see that all the drive is just being sent to this single rear wheel. But as we apply more throttle, see what happens. The differential eventually starts to lock up and drives off the rollers. Now let's take a look at how the new D-Max compares. It's on the transmission rollers. We've got it selected in standard two-wheel drive, rear-wheel drive. But it's worth mentioning at this point that the new Isuzu D-Max does not have a limited slip differential. Instead, it uses something called brake traction control. And this is a very effective and smooth way of distributing the traction to the wheel that needs it, that has the grip. As we set off, very similar to the Rodeo, we start to get some wheel spin. But again, as we increase throttle, it transfers the power across to the wheel that has the grip and sets off quite smoothly. So as you can see there's no real need for a limited slip differential. With this system you also get the benefits of lower road noise and better fuel consumption. Now let's take a look at how the new Isuzu D-Max compares in four-wheel drive. In four-wheel drive high the Rodeo and the new Isuzu D-Max are much the same. Both are selectable electronically and also whilst on the move or stationary. The more modern graphics on the Isuzu D-Max, however, give the driver more information regarding selection and less possibilities of accidentally selecting four-wheel drive whilst on the move. Also, as you may expect, the Isuzu D-Max's more advanced brake traction control system has improved off-road ability. This is clear to see when we place both pickups on three rollers. Now, even though the Rodeo is fitted with a limited slip differential in the rear axle, if we try and set off in this situation, you can see that it really just generates wheel spin and the pickup is actually stuck. So now we've got exactly the same situation. We're using three rollers and when we try and set off this time, you see the pickup generates wheel spin, but with the all new brake traction control system, the power is transmitted to the wheel with the grip and the pickup easily sets off the rollers. Now let's have a look from the other side. When we try and set off you can see that wheel spin is initially generated but quickly the brake traction control system transmits the power to the front wheel and the pickup drives easily off the rollers. I think you'll agree that's a fantastic demonstration. Finally we take a look at four-wheel drive low ratio. This option reduces the gear ratios and therefore offers better pulling power at low speeds. Now both the Rodeo and the Isuzu D-Max offer the same benefits of low ratio and four-wheel drive. We all know that if we are stuck in mud or snow, you need to generate wheel spin to clear the tyre treads and generate some friction with the surface. The new D-Max adjusts its electronic system to allow this to happen and get you out of the situation. For the more serious off-roaders, the way it works is as follows. In high range, a short press of the traction control button will deactivate the engine torque reduction feature of the traction control. This is done automatically when low range is selected. Further to this, a longer press of six seconds will deactivate the whole system, including the brake traction control. So in summary, the all new Isuzu D-Max utilizes the very latest electronically controlled systems and eliminates the need for a limited slip differential. Its off-road ability is improved over an already world-beating Isuzu Rodeo. Yet incredibly, it offers improved fuel efficiency, improved on-road handling and reduced road noise. A truly amazing pickup from Isuzu, the pickup professionals.